After reviewing 50 applications from across the U.S., it came down to one candidate with all the right stuff to take the helm as the new police chief of Holly Hill. Tonight, residents got a chance to get to know police chief Byron Williams at a meet and greet at City Hall. As West Chew's Gail Pascal Brown reports, Williams takes over after the former police chief resigned in a troubled department swirling with allegations of sexual harassment. Come on up and introduce yourself. Byron Williams, a 25-year veteran with the Daytona Beach Police Department, is Holly Hill's new police chief. I was very humbled, though. Um, humbled that, the, uh, that God has allowed me to be where I am and put me in this place that I am right now. He says Holly Hill is a great opportunity and a great city, despite the allegations of sexual harassment among police leadership, where the police chief and two high-ranking officers resigned. It's a disgrace to the profession, disgrace to the ones that are in management, it should not have happened, but it did. We can't continue to look back. It's time to look forward. And that is my desire right now. I'm looking forward. How do you expect to turn everything around here? Consistency. Uh, preach. I preached it, and I just got to walk the walk with that. Um, I believe in uh, being the example, leading by example. Williams says it's about building professionalism, integrity, and respect. One of that's going to start on day one with me is trying to start uh, building a relationship with my officers. I'm doing a one-on-one -on -one session with every staff member in that police department. To get to know their needs, their recommendations on how to make the Holly Hill Police Department successful. I definitely want to see more equipment um, given to the officers. I want to see more officers on the street. Um, I, it's a long-term goal, but a new building I, as any director would want, uh, a new facility. I think even a uh, better, more communication with the community. What are you looking at in the way of training? Some of the stuff I'm looking to bring in immediately is sexual harassment training. Um, I would say uh, cultural diversity training. Chief Williams officially takes office July 8th, but the public swearing in is actually scheduled for July 9th, right here in Holly Hill City Hall at 6 p.m. I'm Gail Pascal Brown in Holly Hill for West 2 News.